get ready. Campbelltown station, which is the train station. We're here for the next 40 odd minutes, waiting for our train to go all the way down to Mossvale, which is somewhere in the southwest, far off the map, all the way down in the southwest of New South Wales. Um, that trade and over there. And. Now, believe it or not, every other place in this is before we Can you believe it? A card on the this is amazing for Campbelltown. I hope this has been enlightening for you to find out that Campbelltown isn't so pogo after all. Yeah. Yeah. Campbelltown has freight trains. What the fuck? Talk. Welcome back. We are in the middle of nowhere right now. I state my that's correct statement. Yes, we are literally in the middle of nowhere. I've just counted 13 houses so far and we've been on this train for like 20 odd minutes. 13 houses is like unbelievable. We're in the middle of fucking nowhere. And we're going to Mitigon, which apparently actually has a Westfield bring you updates when we get there because I don't really think you viewers want to watch a boring train ride in the middle of nowhere for the next 40 odd minutes. I have to add any words Tim do you? There is a new Westfield it's just a McDonald's. A McDonald's not a Westfield I correct my statement. Still a McDonald's is an improvement and we will show you when we arrive. Unless you want to actually film and let these viewers endure such a boring train ride in the middle. Oh well, look, a highway! I don't know if you can see that. That's just a brief glimpse and we're back in the middle of nowhere pretty much. Well, we can't see. There might be like theme parks on either side of these hills for we know. We can bring you updates in just 10 seconds. Oh, there's a couple of houses on a the hill. There's a lot of trees and... So many road and... Creek and oh, there's a dirt track. And, oh, there's another dirt track there. Nothing else. Bye. Hello, welcome back. We are here in the middle of nowhere, Mitigon, next to Mitigon train station car park. And now we're trying to find a McDonald's. There's actually a road here, believe it or not. Now, this is the first thing I want to point out. Look at the police station. This is just a joke, I must say. That's a police station. God, it looks like someone's house for God's sake. Not a police station. This is a complete joke. I mean, come on, the mythical. The mythical should be in brackets underneath it, middle of nowhere. Be warned. People who visit here may be into quite a shock of boredom and nothing else. But I think that's literally in the middle of fucking nowhere. A surgery place? I'm surprised. Really. Bus place, I'm really surprised. I believe it or not, I was surprised when I heard about the train stop. And when I saw the police station as well. Jeff, don't men mention the weather. On the weather here, we are so far out of Sydney, believe it or not, that it's colder. What's the temperature here right now, Tim? It's 13 degrees. 13 degrees here, and in Sydney it's something like 20 odd degrees. 16 degrees. 16 degrees in Sydney, 13 degrees here. We dropped three whole fucking degrees, which is a lot when you're this low down in the temperature. Three degrees drop in temperature when you're under 120. A lot. And you can definitely feel it. Now, now we're trying to find this McDonald's, this so-called McDonald's. <laughs> I, I still don't believe there's one here, but we will show you because we are going to film our trip from here to McDonald's. Now, where do we go? We're going to the left. All right. You film me. 
There's only two long shops here. Cafes and whatnot. But still, I call it the middle of nowhere. I mean, this is literally the centre of the city. You're not going to get much more denser than this. I'm trying to get the camera still. This is a joke compared to Sydney, that's what you have. This is a joke compared to Togo. What's this? Gone. This is a country town, Chester. This is what they're like. Maybe they sell expensive stuff, but it's open map because we're getting too expensive. Prices are probably different, we'll probably show that down. Um, that uniforms will probably be different because they were different in Togo, so definitely different down here. That is if there is such thing as McDonald's down here. And the Google Maps isn't doing a lot of us. <laughs> Which could be possible. Mittagong, Cakes and Pies, Chinese Restaurant Station, BLT Coffee House. Still no McDonald's. It's further down, Chester. Oh, down. Playhouse. Little sale. God, we are literally. I remember there's a Macca's should be down the end of this hill. Down the end of the hill. Should be down there near the traffic lights. Okay. That actually does look like a place to put a Macca's. Vinny's. Well, every place we've gone, I think. You don't have vintage, you're not really a town, are you? That's like one of the worst shops in the history of the universe in my opinion. So what did I say about you don't have vintage, you're not a town? You have vintage, you're not a town, is what I should say, but then again, I suppose it's every single town requirement to have one, I suppose. There's actually a home place here. How many houses are there here? Definitely under 500. Now, what's the population of Vitagon? 500, 400, 300? I think warm. Under 100. Uh, under 100. Must be close around between 100 and 300. 350 maybe. Maybe not even that. Tourist driver. Who wants to do a drive? Look, Dan Murphy. You forgot. They're spending more money on stuff like, like booze when there's not even enough people to buy that much booze. Look at the size of that Dan Murphy. I bet there's not even enough people in this place at all. In this place to buy that much booze, unless they're really, really heavy ass drinkers. It's ridiculous. And if we zoom in, McDonald's. The WHS. Let's hope it's not sharp. Look at Blockbuster. How big that? And you'll see us when we get inside McDonald's. Welcome back. I'm still in Mittagong and believe it or not, there's an RSL club. James Lou, that's how your dad to come here for his gambling. Now, the TAV, right? See, we're still in Mittagong. Mittagong RSL club motel. And there's a car that just fell on the car. And there's another one. Well, here's the McDonald's. We were. Were... That we weren't, that we didn't, that we went. This is the one we filmed in our last video by Zoom. As you can see, they ran out of coat glasses. Welcome to McDonald's. Thank you for watching.